Should go anytime? It's filming. Go. Mary Margaret Ochinski, wearing a jacket with the front cut in the style of a tuxedo, is made of black corduroy for the casual look. Underneath is a black and gray striped shirt with pleated sleeves. The shoulders are padded to make them look puffed. The pants are white corduroy made by Gitana. It's baggy on the top with pleated pockets. It's tightly fitted around the calf and tied in a shoe-like style to fit snug. Because of its color and style, it can be worn with just about anything. Worn with the outfit are a pair of black leather pumps. The outfit is also worn with silver jewelry to dress it up. Miss Mary Margaret Ochinski. Dress it up. Miss Mary Margaret Ochinski. The Designer Look by Sergio Valente. Slim corduroy jeans have the casual look with detailed styling, topped by a gray Sergio Valente shirt, featuring zip closure front and tab belted collar, accentuated with stylized stitches to offset the Valente design on the pocket. Watch by Jordash is digital, and below, calf boots in the tan to complement the, the outfit. The black leather fitted waist style jacket has considerable stitching detail and completes the total casual look. Mr. Vinnie Martin. Here we have Chris Wagenti wearing a peacock blue elongated back sleeve shirt with black capizio pants and black studded high heel boots. Topping off this stylish punk outfit is a black felt hat with black satin ribbon. An added accessory is a small black purse with an extra long thin strap worn as a belt. Thank you, Chris. Stay cool this summer and get into a matching short and shirt set, like the one Scott is modeling now. It's made of polyester and cotton and is also machine washable. Down each side of the shorts, there is a matching white terry cloth strip. The entire outfit is in refreshing white trimmed in blue. Thank you, Scott.
Maria Luna modeling an attractive black ski suit designed by Rosing now. This ski suit is the, accented with gray striping around the ski jacket arms. The suit is very durable, is made for much more warm weather. The pants are made for good stretching, flexibility, and they are also high cut with suspenders attached. Now Joe Luna will be the best dressed skier on the slopes. Chris is wearing a down-filled black ski suit, perfect for a day on the slopes or perhaps sleigh riding. The underneath garment is a waist-high jumper with a zipper front. To complete the look, she is missing her ski boots, so the leather ones will have to do. Thank you, Chris. Anthony is modeling designer menswear by Yves Saint Laurent. The trousers are black, brushed corduroys, nicely accented by a red and black knit belt. The shirt is a traditional plaid, accented with shades of blue and green. A red knit tie worn in an open knot complements the top. The boots worn by Anthony are brown leather fashion fashioned in a typical Western style design. The watch worn is a black banded simple face watch, complements of Tiffany and Company. A unique blend of traditional and contemporary styles, this outfit is equally suitable at the formal and casual affair. Thank you, Anthony. Mike has chosen this sporty outfit to wear to school. He is wearing navy blue pants, accented with a light blue man-tailored shirt. Along with the pants, he has a navy blue belt with white sneakers, accented with red leather. He is wearing a black leather jacket to complete that sporty look. Roseanne Morrell has coordinated one of the fashionable looks of the 80s. With her black knee leg length knickers, notice the side pockets as she has accented her knickers with a black and red sweater topped with the main sleeves. She is also wearing a red belt that goes great with the outfit. Roseanne has added her own touch with the French style barrette and a feather to the side. The shoes she chose are black patent leather pumps. Thanks, Ro. Leah Rose has chosen a striped, multicolor cropped pants outfit to give a casual look for any occasion. The Christian Dior pants are loose and comfortably cut off just above the ankle. The pants are tapped with a black scoop neck sweater. To look, the look is accepted with a black leather belt and shoes. Thank you, Leah.
Scott will start off his evening by wearing a white designer Falcon Court V-neck sweater. He's wearing black leaves and white pony sneakers. His jacket is a satin lined black leather which dresses up the outfit. This is a very comfortable look and suits Scott's own look to the fullest. Thank you, Scott. Mike has chosen this sporty outfit to wear to school. He is wearing a navy blue pants with a belt highlighted with a light blue man tailored shirt. Along with the pants and the shirt, he is wearing white Converse sneakers with red accents and a black leather jacket to give that sporty look. Denise is wearing a sporty outfit which can be worn comfortably to any casual social event. The basic black bodysuit was designed by Sassoon. It's worn with a dungaree skirt. The skirt comes tight at the waist and flares toward the bottom. The high black pumps put a touch of class to the outfit. The accessories which accent the outfit are the matching leather black belt dangling silver bracelet on each arm and on the hands sparkle two silver rings with pink stones and the ears silver earrings that add shine. Brian is wearing everyday school wear, which is casual and comfortable. He wears an Iron Maiden concert shirt with, arm, with the arms camouflage. His light brown pants are loose fitting to add to the casualty of the style. They are corduroy jeans designed by Lee. On his feet he wears this ever popular Timberland boots. Almost any male student can be seen wearing this rugged outfit. Robert Stark Summer Sportswear of 83. On the deck is Jonathan in Robertson Sportswear. For on the waterfront, you're ready for duty after six with a drink to mix. Notice the band collar tuxedo shirt, anchored by a sleek, slender, pleated bib front. The tuxedo shirts come in an array of sizes and colors for the, for the perfect price of $52. A not so formal stance of cool, comfortable cotton sheeting slacks an array of colors and sizes for only $37. Also note the leather loafers which balances the style. For those warm, elegant evening occasions, which at Liberty you'll discover GQ wear geared for ship and shore, so this look from GQ's Robinson. Evening sports with that warm, sexual, elegant touch. Evening sports are with the wrong sexual elegant touch. For a more mysterious look, David is wearing a long black overcoat with Lamborghini sunglasses and boots by Texas Steer. The black overcoat is exceptionally good for shoplifting on the go. Thank you, David.
Dan Perotti is wearing a stylish combination of his own. Jeans and shirt are designed by Jordas. Also note he's wearing designer boots. The shirt and gray are maroon and yellowish stripes. Also wearing a maroon belt to bring out the color of the shirt. On the top of everything, all of the bad summer weather for the blazer with the sleeves rolled up for that sporty look. That makes a great summer outfit. Now, here's Donna, modeling a one-piece v-neck satin jumpsuit. The jumpsuit has tapering puffy sleeves and tapering legs with pleats at the bottom. The jumpsuit is accented with a pair of low-heeled black satin bowed evening pumps. With this jumpsuit, Donna is now ready for an elegant evening out on the town. Thank you. <laughs> White corduroys with a brown velour shirt that has tan puffs on the shoulders. He's also wearing tan work boots that match his outfit. Thank you, Tom. <laughs> Oh, no, I go now. Wearing a hot pink shirt, which has plain long sleeves in front view, and on the back view, there is a button neck and is b black lace below. She is also wearing black baggy pants with front and back pockets to match the black lace of the shirt. Her boots are black suede with heels. Thank you, Patty. She is wearing black corduroy Gloria Vanderbilt pants. They can be worn with a formal blouse for nighttime use or with a white sweater for casual daytime use. The shoes Julie chose are white leather capizios with black shoelaces to match the colors of the outfit. Thank you, Julie. Steve is wearing a suave outfit, ready to hang out with the guys. It's called the faded denim look. He's wearing Jordache designer jeans worn many times. The sweatshirt is bright blue covered by a faded denim jacket to match his pants. And in the jacket pocket, the old black brush is sticking out in case he wants to look his coolest. And to finish out this faded look, he's wearing shaded Ferrari glasses. Steve's now ready to be comfortable and dressed to hang out with the gang. Here's Mike Priori wearing a polyester and cotton plaid western shirt with beige polyester dress pants and, a matching sho and matching shoes showing us the casual look. This is Mike Priori.
Our next model is Chris. Chris is wearing a black knit sweater with white stripes on the sleeves. The pants she's wearing are Lee jeans. Her sneakers are Nikes, a well-known name in sneakers. The black, sweat wrist, black wristbands put a touch of sport to her outfit. Thank you, Chris. This is the last outfit of our show. Tulio is ready to go hang out with his gang. He looks tough with the clothes he wears. His pants are black corduroy with a light blue shirt with stars on the pockets. The hole in the shirt adds to this rugged outlook. Over the shirt, he wears a blue jeans jacket with the sleeves cut off. On his feet, he wears brown Timberland boots. And to finish this outfit, a green bandana is worn around the head. Now Tulio is ready to go and hang out.